Good morning. I thought I would bring this to the collective regarding the awakened from my sleep this morning. My daughter called me and it was, well, from the recording, it was 420. And um, the first words out of her mouth was, Ma, I had a dream about an alien invasion. So that's what I'm going to call the video, Alien Invasion. So um, I recorded the dream and what I'm going to be doing is interpreting the dream. So again, I'm bringing my gifts to humanity. I'm not ashamed anymore of me all my life knowing that I saw what other people didn't see. I heard what they didn't hear. I reasoned different than they reasoned. And as I got older, it drew me closer, the connection of my spiritual walk, the God within me. And now expressing God within me, expressing it outwardly. I am God. We are God. And now this dream is basically aligning what is going on here in the natural as above, so below. <clears throat> Excuse me. Okay, to go ahead and um, I'm going to let you hear the let you hear the dream as I recorded it. Okay, let's see. Let me turn it up. No, I don't want that. All right, let's see. Okay, I'm just going to play it and let you hear the uh, recording. Let me start it over because I think it was too low. Hold on. Um, I was with the friend guy and we went to the park or something. We were doing something in the park and then all of a sudden something appeared in the sky. It was magical, but he 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 said it was a plane. It, it was like it just appeared in the sky. I was like, what is that? And he was like. Uh, it was a, he was like, that's a plane. I said, no, that ain't no plane. Then I said, come on. Then I took off running back to the house. We running, we running, we running. And then all of a sudden, people all around me just started falling asleep. Some people fell asleep. Some people stayed up. I was one of the ones that stayed up. But I felt sleepy. I felt like, but I didn't want it to get me. So I made myself stay up. And, um... Everybody just falling off so one by one, one by one. And um, the next thing I, I just started praying, I said, and I was like, I said, thank you, my God, thank you, my, my Father, thank you, my Creator, thank you, universe. And then I just woke up. Oh, boy, boy, that's beautiful. And then I remember saying to myself, that's, that's how I know. I, I remember saying to myself, I was like, they said something big was going to happen in 2021. That's, that's how I know it's going to happen in 2021 because I said it. Mm -hmm. I said, they said something else is going to happen big. Like, this is going to happen in 2021. And that's when I went to praying and I said, if I make it out of this, I'm moving back home, close to my family. Mm -hmm. If we make it out of this. Mm -hmm. <laughs> so... Okay, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to play the recording and break it down as it's being uh, said. And I hope it's coming over loud because I this is not pre-recorded or anything. It's spur of the moment. Okay, let's start it over again. Um, 
Okay. She was with a friend guy. What's happening now here on earth? As above, so below. The switch, the transformation, the tables turning. The last shall be first, first of all of this that's going on here on earth at this time. Hold on, let me close this door. Okay, all of this that is going on at this time here on earth. Uh, she says she was with a friend guy. W whether it's our family members. Whether it's our loved ones. Our friends. Our spouses. Our uh, co-workers. Our very neighbors. We could be right there with that person. With these people. There is a division. She was with a friend guy. You're going to be right with our everyday ordinary living. But there's something different between this person and that person. You you could be right there with them. But there's there there could be a big major difference between you and another person. Two people together, but two major what which side or something okay let's keep going she was with the friend guy we went to the park or something. okay she was with the friend guy they went to the park i like that they went to the park so that's showing you that it's it's two people two different two different sides they're in the same places doing the same things but it's two different maybe two different agendas or two different mindsets or two different uh, uh, high vibrating low vibrating whatever it's, it's, a, it's a difference you can be with people but you may be on different one on this side and one on that side what's happening here on earth is a big a major division I don't care what your belief, what your spiritual uh, faith, walk, I don't uh, what religion, I don't care which one. That's not what's going to determine what side this thing is on. Your heart is what's going to determine that. Your love walk. Okay, so again, she said we were at the park. So it's, I'm glad again she mentioned the park because it's recreational. It's fun. Being on the high vibration, it's it. You see the excitement of what's going on, while others may see the doom of what's going on. You could see the doom on the high vibration, but you you're not really relating to it because you're in a different realm. You're an alien here on this earth. Those that are walking in the 5D, I may be getting ahead of myself, but those that are walking in the 5D, in, in the, 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 the high vibrations, in the elements of the spiritual, you, you, your experience is an enlightenment, is, is, is joy. Even though doom, you're, you're somehow in your spirit has a part energy life ex high expectations of of gold at the end of the rainbow how could you have that type of expectation when the world is going through hell here on earth it's two different sides so she's at the park they're at the park they're both at the park they both could be doing the same thing, but one could be experiencing this park. Okay, let me keep going. Okay, because I'm I think I'm, I'm getting way ahead of myself. We were doing something in the park, and then all of a sudden something appeared in the sky. Okay. 
something appeared in the sky. This is a high vibration, high fifth dimension way of life. Love is the highest to connect to the spiritual realm. We've got to be we've got to come high. We've got to come from within and, and show, expressing without from the highest vibration. Whether it's from the sky or from within, it's a spiritual high vibrating fifth dimension spiritual realm coming from within love is the highest vibration coming from the sky coming from the spiritual coming from your spirit coming from God within she said okay let me rewind that she said it was magical again what's going on here in this world basically it's not over the doomsday story is not over The story is not over regarding the destruction, the, 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 the turmoil, the, the, the crime, the deaths. It's not over what this world is going through. But why does one see it magical? Magical. From the sky. They're seeing it from two different, from two different elements. I, I, I apologize. I'm getting this from two different. Stop, stop, stop. I'm on the wrong one. One moment. Um, okay. I was with this friend, guys, and we went to the park or something. We were doing something in the park, and then all of a sudden, something appeared in the sky. It was magical, but he, he, he said it was a plane. It, it, Again, he said it was a plane. She interpreted it as something magical. Same scenarios, but you're seeing it different ways. You're feeling it different ways. It just appeared in the sky. I was like, what is that? And he was like, uh, she asked the question, what is that? The ones that are walking in the spirit, living their lives from the heart, from the intuition, from living a life wanting to please their source, their higher power coming from within. There are things going to be happening in our natural environment even we're going to be asking the question, what is this? What is going on? We will even, but something in us will know. We will know. It may strike fear in the beginning. It may startle us in the beginning. But then something within will get us in alignment to not be in fear. So far what's going on in this world. There are those walking in fear. And yet there are those. That are walking. Aware. Of what's going on in the world. But not under the spirit of fear. They're staying in the spirit. Of protection. Provision. Love. Keeping high vibrating thoughts. 
not focusing everything around fear. What is that? We may be startled in the beginning. We may ask the questions, but then something within is going to grip us to be in alignment with what's going on above, not what's going on below. We will be aware and 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 and, and know that we are here on earth, but we're aliens. This is not our home. Our home is within. We're not secure and 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 have all our hope and security here on this land. There is a bigger picture and that picture is from within. We've got to have the faith and the hope of, of whatever faith, spiritual belief we have coming from within. I may be going ahead of myself. It was a, you know, that's a pain. I said, no, that ain't no pain. Then I said, come on. Then I took off running back to the house. We running, we running, we running. Again, you may be startled. You may be, we're human. That fear may come upon us, but we're not going to stay in that fear. Because we're human. We're here on this earth. We see what's going on. We, we're not going to walk in, in, in naive or ignorant of what's going on in this world. No, we're going to be wise. And according to this world, we will do what it takes to make sure we stay divided with the consequences of this world. We're in it, but we're not of it. We are aliens. We are from within, from the sky, from the spirit here on this earth. We've got to be living and moving and having our being from within to escape the, the destruction and the, 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 the doom of this world, this earth, because it's not over. It is not over. And neither is it not over of the higher levels of an, it, it evolving in the higher vibrating levels either. Getting to know yourself more and more is not over either. To those that are living from within. Because if you're not living from within, things are domino affecting downward. But those that are living from the heart, from the spirit... Your life is evolving. You're awakening to who you are. And you are God. You are manifesting life. Prosperity. Hope. Joy. Peace. But those that are not coming from within the spirit realm. From the sky. Your domino effect. Your life is, is deteriorating. And all of a sudden, people all oh, and, and before I keep going, she said, she said, come on. Let me rewind that a little bit. That's where I want to stop it on. She say, we running and running. So her goal of where she's running to is back to the house. Run back to home. From within. That is your safety net. That is your security. That is your salvation. Going within. Having your hope and your faith in your God. Your creator. Your source. Your higher power. That is going back home. That is running back home. When all this mess around us. We're in it, but we're not of it. Run home. Run to your salvation. Run to your creator, your God. You are God. God within you. Your security, your safety. Run home. I hear the song in my head. Getting to know you. 
getting to know all about you. I don't even know the tune. But get to know you. Get to know who the true you are. You are God. And you are going to be evolving more and more into the to the to the knowledge to know who you are because God is within you and God is on the scene. That is that alien invasion. God showing up here on this earth through us. Those that are connected. He's expressing the universe, God, the higher power source is respecting, res expressing the energy, energy outwardly through us. We are the face of God. We are the hands of God. We are the voice of God. And we are the power of God. There is a war. But it's not the war that you're thinking with bats and guns and fists. It's the war of love, peace against. Stay in the high vibration. Run home. Run within and let God show up and show out through you. Why are we running? And then all of a sudden, people all around me just started falling asleep. Some people fell asleep. The division, the countdown, I see the countdown basically over. I, I made videos two or three. <clears throat> saying five four three two one like it's a countdown and now in my spirit i'm feeling like the countdown is over the countdown is over you either here or you either there it's subtle you won't know that this is happening but you will see it in living color two different worlds one of the sky of the spirit from within and one without here on this earth two different realms 3d and 5d third dimension and fifth dimension from the spirit and from the natural you're doing the same thing you're looking the same way but it's it, you're going to be expressing things a different way and the world is going to be expressing the hellish in another way as well Some people stayed up. I was one of the ones that stayed up. But I felt. Some are awake. And some are asleep. Some are awake. And some are asleep. Some are coming from the sky. From the spirit. From, the, from your heart. From God. And some are natural, trusting in things of the world. And they're in a doomsday atmosphere when you could be in a higher dimension, magical park, home. I felt like, but I didn't want it to get me, so I made myself stay up. And... Again, we could be doing the same things. You won't tell the difference whether they're on this dimension or that dimension, whether they're in the spirit or in the natural, whether they're coming from the heart or coming from hell. You won't really tell the difference, but it, it, it's getting to the point you will see it plain as day. And some of the things we did, we won't do no more because it may cause our our vibrating level to come down. Everything that the, the everything that the 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 the, the fifth dimension uh, mindset spiritual beings are doing, aliens are about is about raising to a higher vibration, raising their awareness, raising their consciousness of God within and without. 
getting to know themselves more and more staying awake not keep participating in things that will not raise our knowledge and our uh, uh, awareness of who we are we have got to stay awake and and and, and keep evolving because if you're awake, you're going to be evolving to more higher ele uh, ele elevations, higher vibrating levels, higher wisdom, higher power, alien invasion. Yes, we, we are the aliens. We are invading. God is here. Through us, we are God. Um, everybody just falling off one by one, one by one. And um, the next thing I, I just started praying, I said, and I was like, I said, thank you, my God. Thank you, my, my Father. Thank you, my Creator. Thank you, universe. And then I just woke up. Again, what made her, what was going on in the world, she ran within she ran home she ran to the sky she ran to the spirit to 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 god and i like that she was in a a thankful attitude we need to be in thankfulness no matter what situation that we're in because the world is going through stuff it's going it's in it and we may be right there amongst it, but we stay thankful. We don't walk in fear. We stay thankful knowing that we are protected, knowing that we are divine, knowing that we know it shall not come near us. It won't touch us. We've got to know this and to know that you've got to be within. You've got to be on that fifth dimension. That higher level of vibrating, of love and peace. You can't be in the confusion. You can't be in the confusion in the mass destruction of the world. In the chaos. You've got to be coming from a spirit of love. That's the God within us expressing without. Magical things are going to be happening. And destructive things will be happening as well. Park. Recreation things will be happening. Total chaos. Division will be happening as well. Oh boy, boy, that's beautiful. And then I was understanding myself. That's that's how I know. I, I remember saying to myself, I was like, they said something big was gonna happen in twenty twenty one. That's that's how I know it's gonna happen in twenty twenty one because I said it. Mm -hmm. I said they said something else was gonna have something big. Like this is going to happen in 2021. And that's what I went to pray. And I said, if I make it out of this, I'm moving back home. I'm close to my family. Mm. We make it out of this. Mm. <laughs> so. Boy. So that was 2021. Because I was saying those exact words. Mm -hmm. So. Okay. That was the end of it. So. What? I'm gathering 2021 2021 that it's now it's now the great awakening the tables have turned Plain as day, we will see the division, the separation of who is who. You're going to know. 
I had to put this video right back. I had to come right back. I stopped it, but I forgot. It was 420 when she called and gave me the dream. Let me read to you the the uh, the message of 420, 420. And to show you how in sync this thing really is. Four, the number four. <clears throat> the number of creative work. We have alien activity going on. <laughs> alien invasion and alien activity going on. The number of organization, sometimes referred to as the world number. There is alien activity going on in the world to cause this alien invasion. The number two, the number of separation, witness or opposites. You will be right there with people, but there will be those on this side and those on that side. And it will be plain as day to see which side who is on. You will know Two is separation. It, 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 I'm telling you, it's a 30-second countdown to separation. Zero. I don't see the number zero, but the number zero to me, that's the spirit. That 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 is the divine. That's the source. That's source. That's all power. That's most high God. That's your that's you. And 20. The number of expectancy. The one, sh it is one short of the ultimate of spiritual perfection. This is the time. The time is now for the 30 second countdown for the spiritual perfection of perfecting the alien invasion. Four two zero. The separation. The 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 um the creative work, the alien activities, the organizing. This is the spiritual organizing for this alien invasion. The, and here in this world, it's the world number. And the separation. Here, here. And the number of expectancy, 20. This, this is what we know is what's happening. So let us keep expecting the part, the recreation, the, the magical, the good, the lovely, the pure. And the expectation of the other side, they can expect more doom. It is one short of the ultimate spiritual perfection. Let us keep the high expectancy of the love of the spiritual invasion taking over this world. Love conquers all. Okay. Have a blessed day.